is obviously about making time for Jehovah and in this clip uh, the gentleman is sweeping his yard and notices the time oh it's time for me to do my bible reading <laughs> why am I still sweeping the yard when it's bible reading time so he runs and gets his silver sword and he sits on the bench and imagines himself in paradise with an elephant walking past. <laughs> yeah, so this, this is the level of devotion that you need as a Jehovah's Witness. You need to look the part. You need to wear the right clothes. Nothing immodest. And you need to make time for... cares passionately about his work, especially, I'm quoting him here, especially my work as an advocate against the cover-up of child sex abuse. Sorry, this is the guy who went to a country that is known for child sex abuse and, and paid for girls who look about 20 to service little Lloyd. This, it doesn't even add up. It's just how can you still say that you, you, you want to be an advocate of 
the cover-up of child sex abuse when you've used the services of, of people, young girls, who probably were abused as children at an early stage in the industry, which is why Mark O'Donnell, as, uh, that was the point Mark O'Donnell made, and also the point that Javier Ortiz also made as well. Why Evans cannot see this, I do not get it. And yet he, basically Evans is saying here that, I've got to carry on my work because without my work, you know, we're not going to, you, you, you're not, we're not going to help all those ones who are trying to recover. Sorry, Lloyd, you're the, probably the worst person in the world you, 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 who, who anybody needs to go to to try and get assistance when they've been involved in the cover-up of child sex abuse.